Hey, this is KJ. Welcome home. Check it out, man. I know I've been speaking to the people all the time, but right now I want to speak to my chosen ones. And when I say chosen ones, I'm talking about those that has been spiritually handpicked by God for for whatever reason. Uh, you might got a gift or it just could be God single you out for a reason. I feel like every family has one. Uh, it's almost like what I mean by chosen one, let's say it like this here. Let's say you are part of a family, your mama, your daddy, your, your uncles, your aunts and cousins and everybody else. But you feel in your heart as though you feel like you a stranger, almost like you ain't from them or you not almost like you ain't from this world. Like, like, like you heal in the world or in your family, but you separate. You, you just automatically, you spiritually separate. It's a reason why. And I had to tell myself this and I had to motivate myself. The reason why is there's, there's a light shining on you. Specifically, there's a specific chosen light. God is shining on you that you are the one that's, that's meant to make a change. You are the one that's meant to make this breakthrough happen. You are the one to, you are the one that's going to shock your foes, your friends, your frenemies, and even your families. And even and you're going to shock even yourself. That's why. That's why you don't fit in. That's why you always misunderstood. That's why nobody understand you. Nobody probably never will until they see your miracle happen. It's like no matter what you do in life, it seems like you never can't get ahead for some reason. Or it seems like no matter what you do in life, it seems like somebody always got something to say. Enough is just never good enough. No matter what you try to do. No matter what you try to say. No matter how you try to move. It always seems like why is enough is just never good enough. Well, I'm here to tell you to my chosen one, because I'm a chosen one. Whatever you desire, whatever you passionate at, go for that. Stay silent. Stay to yourself. Stay away and keep going in your dream. Keep going in your passion. Keep going in your destiny, your prophecy that was really meant. Because one thing I learned, nobody never will believe in your plan until they see your plan manifest. So keep going. And I guarantee you, I guarantee you, man, you're going to see why you really was the chosen one.